Hi, my name is Marco with MNR Printing Equipment and today I'm going to show you how to clean the head plate on your Quattro DTF machine. So in order to clean the bottom of your head plate in your Quattro DTF machine, you're just going to need a couple items. You're going to need some Quattro cleaning fluid that I've gone ahead and poured a little bit into the cap so that I don't contaminate my bottle. I'm going to need a couple foam tip swabs just like these and you are also going to need poly wipes and the poly wipes are going to be very important because those are going to be the only material that you want to use when you're cleaning the bottom of the head plate and any interaction with the actual print heads themselves. So to gain access to the bottom of the print head plate what I need to go ahead and do is I need to press and hold the left arrow button once again to move the print carriage all the way over to the left so I can get to it from the other side of the machine. So in order to gain access to the bottom of the head plate, I just need to go ahead and open the door and let it rest down. So the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take a clean poly wipe and some of your MNR Quasho cleaning solution and you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna get the poly wipe pretty wet with the solution. You don't wanna have a dry wipe when you're cleaning underneath here. So the areas that I'm going to focus on first are not going to be the actual print heads because I do want to try to avoid those as much as possible, but I am going to be cleaning the entire head plate that is all the way around all four print heads. So I'm just going to take my poly wipe and fold it up a little bit smaller so it's a little bit more manageable. And I'm just going to look underneath and I'm going to inspect it first to make sure I don't have any damage. And I'm also going to make sure that I don't have any large areas of dry ink that I need to scrape off. When you're cleaning, again, avoid the print heads, but it is okay to go around them with the poly wipe only. So once you're completed with that, the next step that I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to focus on the edges of the print heads themselves. So in order to do that, these are where your foam tip swabs will come into play and the eye clean that you went ahead and poured into your cap so you don't contaminate your larger bottle of cleaning solution. The areas that I want to focus on are my edges. I'm not getting on top of the print head. I'm just focusing on my edges around the head. These are going to be the areas that seal up when the capping station is capped against them. And again, when I do this, I'm making sure that I don't have any dry ink built up or anything along those lines. And if you do, you need to go ahead and remove it. So once you're done cleaning the bottom of the head plate and all the surrounding areas, what you're gonna go ahead and do is you're gonna press X reset and you're gonna bring the print carriage back over to the capping station. Once that's done, you need to do one final normal clean because you were down there playing around with the bottom of the print heads. So you wanna have your final clean done by the wiper blades of the machine. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press clean. My pop-up window comes up and I'm gonna make sure that I have normal clean checked and all four print heads are checked. And then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna hit accept and let it do a cleaning cycle. Thank you for watching our video about our Quattro DTF machine. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call or you can reach us at mrprint.com and all of the information is gonna be below in this video.